Hi, I'm Shiv Aglani. Thanks for checking out our Raise the Line interview series in which me and my co-host, Osmosis Chief Medical Officer, Dr. Rishi Desai, explore how to strengthen our healthcare system with some amazing leaders in medicine, technology, education, and government. And they have some great advice for people starting careers in healthcare as well. I hope you'll watch these highlights and then go listen to the full podcast interview wherever you get your podcasts. Hi, I'm Shiv Aglani, and today on Raise the Line, I'm happy to be joined by Paul Friedman who's the president of the learning marketplace at Guild Education. So the first question is just telling, telling us a bit more about your background beyond uh, Entangled and Guild. How did you get into the ed tech space? Yeah, so, so I've been in the education space since, you know, I was born, maybe before I was born. My, my, my parents were uh, both worked in higher education. My father was a physics professor. My mother uh, worked in, in administration in college campuses. And I kind of grew up in an education environment. Um, uh, and during that experience, I developed a great passion for what I think education is about at the end of the day, which is just changing somebody's expectations of what they can accomplish. You know, as soon as somebody gets an education past what they expected themselves or what society expected of them, it opens up a whole new world of, of possibilities. And so professionally, I've been, um, you know, I've always done things um, starting at, with the company I started out of college that lowered costs, increased efficacy, um, uh, or expanded the access to, to, to high quality education. You know, we tend to have a, a really uh, broad audience of uh, current and future healthcare professionals. You know, do you have any advice to anyone listening who could potentially be using uh, Guild or getting education through the Guild benefit uh, of what they should be considering as they think about this next stage in their career, uh, maybe a career in healthcare or, or something else? What do you, what are your advice for them? Well, first of all, is, is it's, you know, uh, it, if, as you're thinking about joining, if you don't have an education yet, a, one, a, a great way to get one is to go find an employer who provides very um, uh, generous educational benefits, either with Guild or elsewhere, and work for them while they pay for your education. So it, you know, if you want a debt-free education, uh, go get a job to, to, to go to college. Um, and there's, you know, there's plenty of institutions, um, uh, you know, Walmart, Chipotle, uh, Lowe's, uh, and you know, other Guild partners um, who, who would be happy to have you work there while you're, while you're, while you're learning a healthcare field. Um, uh, second thing is, is I encourage, you know, for those who have ambitions to work in health, healthcare, do it. I mean, it's, it's, it's an incredibly important um, uh, job. Um, it's one that our society is going to need more of, and it's one that where you have an opportunity to make an impact, you know, obviously in people's lives, and one that you also have an opportunity to, um, uh, provide economic stability for yourselves, your family, and your community. So uh, if you're thinking about doing it, if you're doing it, keep it up because the work is, is heroic. Thanks for watching this preview of Raise the Line. To hear the full interview, check out all of our podcasts and subscribe to the series, please go to osmosis.org forward slash Raise the Line podcast or listen wherever you get your podcasts.